Hello YouTube. This is Rizvi here and I'm back with another exciting tutorial for you guys. Today I'll show you how you can make a simple yet very cool letter logo with a drop shadow using Adobe Illustrator in 5 easy steps. Watch it till the end and you'll be able to make a logo for yourself within minutes. If you like the tutorial, leave a like and let's see if I can get 15 likes for this video. Let's jump into the tutorial. First open Illustrator and create a new document. I'd recommend you guys to make it 1920 by 1080 for the sake of working easily. Name the document letter logo. Now we're going to create a letter logo following 5 steps. Step 1. Select the ellipse tool from here and create a perfect circle by pressing shift on your keyboard and dragging it like this. Choose a fill color which is quite bright like this one and turn off the stroke. Then create a new layer and then press anywhere in the document. Press OK when the dialog box pops up and another circle will be created. Put it in the corner of the document as we work with it later. We're done with step 1. In step 2, we're going to create another layer and select the type tool. After that, type a letter you want to work with and scale it up to your own liking. I'm selecting the letter M and the font name is Primetime Regular. If you want to download it, I've given the link in the description. Now place the letter in the middle of the circle. Be sure to make the color of the letter white. Second step complete. Third step is the most important step. Select the text layer and press Ctrl plus C to copy it. After that, press Ctrl plus F twice to paste it two times. You'll have three layers like this. After that, make the top layer invisible. Select the middle layer and make it black from here. After that, select the bottom layer and make its color black as well. Use your arrow keys to separate the bottom layer and place it where you want your shadow to end. If you don't have any idea about it, just follow my instructions. I'm placing the bottom layer here. After that, select the bottom and the middle layer. After that, double click on the blend tool over here. It will activate a dialog box. Select the spacing to be specified distance and put 4 pixels here. Make the orientation align with page. After that, go to object. Then blend and press make. It will create a long shadow like this. This is the drop shadow I was talking about earlier. We've completed step 3. After that, select the second circle that we made at the beginning and place it over the first circle like this. Dot. Make sure the layer of this circle is at the top. After that, Click on the arrow over here and select the blend layer pressing shift on your keyboard. When both the second circle and the blend layer are selected, press Ctrl plus 7. It will get rid of the shadow out of the circle. Step 4, complete. Step 5 is the easiest one. Select this layer written M on it and drag it on top of all the layers. And boom! We're done with all the 5 steps and we now have a cool logo. If you want, you can also select this blend layer and reduce the opacity of this layer from here. Reducing the opacity will give it a more professional look. Now you're good to go. Help you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like and suggestions for making my contents better. That is all for today. Peace out.